To install blades onto the Logan V Groover, remove the yellow blade clips and install blades on both sides of the tool. Then replace the yellow blade clips. Note the magnet embedded into the plastic that holds the blade while you are installing it. The back of the tool features a blade storage area where extra blades can be held. To adjust blade depth on the v Groover, find the blade depth dial on the rear of the tool. This adjusts the blade depth gauge on the underside of the V-Groover, from deeper to more shallow. The Logan Foamworks V-Groover works best in conjunction with the Logan Foamworks channel rail. This guides the cuts to be straight. Always make sure you're using a scrap piece of foam board under the foam board you are going to V-Groove. Use the channel rail to make reference marks where you want the V-Groove to appear. The V-Groover has small notches on it which will align with your reference mark. Hook the V-Groover onto the side of the channel rail in line with the reference mark you made. Adding an extra piece of material at the far end supports the beginning and the end of your cut. Slide the tool forward, depress the blades and pull straight back to create your V-groove.